If you want a real experience and care to test your luck, just go out and buy yourself a used log truck. You can pick one up off of most any lot. Nothing down, mortgage everything you got. Then you get your permits and your PUCs, and you feel like a king, about as tall as the trees. The world's a ripe cherry ready for you to pluck, because at last you've got your own used log truck. Well, things start happening that you didn't count on. She comes all unglued and your money is gone. So what you do then is go into town and establish credit in a few places around. You're a businessman now, and with any kind of luck, you can pay them off quick with your used log truck. Then you and the head loader go a couple rounds, and he gives you 3,000 feet that weighs 80,000 pounds. And the scaler's a crank, deaf and dumb, got bad eyesight and an extra long thumb. The way station's open, just your rotten luck. There goes the next payment on your used log truck. Then you start blowing tires faster than you can count them. So you charge a new set, and when you have the man mount them, you feel kind of bad about the bill you just made, because your fuel bill there is only half paid. But you smile and assure him he won't get stuck, because you can get rolling now with your used log truck. When you do get the haul, you work on it all night. Pretty soon, you and your wife have a fight. She don't understand, it's just gotta be. She says, you love that truck more than the kids and me. She cries a lot lately and complains and howls when you wipe your greasy hands on her new white towels. The wash machine is broke. The dryer motor stuck, and so are you with your used log truck. You got a big grocery bill, and you're behind on your rent. Before you get a dollar, it's already spent. Finally, there comes that sad, sad day when the finance company comes and drags it away. Bankruptcy, then, is the only way out. Man, you thought you'd never take that route. You go back to driving for a big outfit, probably the same one you up and quit. One thing about it, at the end of the day, you get out of that rig and just walk away. You go home to Mama, she's happy again, because at last you got a steady check coming in. But you think about your truck and your mouth gets dry and a little bit of moisture forms in your eye and, and a lump comes up in your throat and gets stuck from all the memories of your used log truck. 